Hey guys, so you've had your nail polish on for a few days and you're getting a little bored with it. So what would you normally do? Change it, right? Well, if it hasn't chipped yet, here's an idea. Instead of changing your nail polish, why not just make it a little more interesting? You could do an accent nail. That would be one way to sort of spruce it up a little bit without having to change the whole thing. Or you could do a tape manicure accent nail. What is a tape manicure accent nail? That's what I'm going to tell you. And I don't even need to do a demo because this is so simple and you don't need to buy anything because you probably have what you already need in your house already. All you need is some ordinary household scotch tape, which you know most people do have in their house, and then whatever you want to use as a polish for your accent nail which would normally be something with glitter or shimmer or a uh, special effects top coat you know what I'm talking about you, I'm sure you have at least one bottle of that already right so here's what I did I started off my manicure a few days ago with SE Bikini Sotini and this is just what I use you can use anything you already have in your collection that you think will look good together. So I already had this on and it's just a pretty periwinkle blue. So I thought, okay, what would look good over that for an accent nail? So I used Essie Lux Effects in Satin Stones. It's a really chunky silver glitter polish and I thought that would look really pretty with the periwinkle blue as an accent nail but like I said you know go through what you have and pair something together because you don't have to use this exact same thing this is just what I used so this is what I decided I was going to use for my accent nail and then just in case you're wondering my base coat was Sally Hansen advanced hard as nails and my top coat is Sally Hansen Insta Dry top coat, the one in the red bottle. And the reason why I say that is they also have another one that's in a clear bottle, but I don't like that one as much as this one. So this is what I had used for my original manicure. Okay, so now you're going to do your glitter top coat accent nail. Get your scotch tape out, and I don't even have to do a demo for this because it's so simple. Get your scotch tape out and decide what shape you want this to be. You're going to do a design, but keep in mind that you can only do shapes with a straight edge because you're going to use tape to create it. So I did a, an elongated triangle shape, and all I did was I just put scotch tape on the areas of my nail that I needed to block off in order to create the shape that I needed. So I just put a, one piece of tape along here and one piece of tape on the other side that formed like triangle sides and then the bottom of my nail formed the base of the triangle. You don't have to do a triangle, you can do a square. You can tape off the bottom part of your nail and paint on a tip. You can tape off the top part of your nail and paint the bottom, whatever you want to do. You can do a diagonal line across half the nail. Let your imagination be your guide. Okay, so just tape off the area that you don't want the polish to be on and then paint on paint on your glitter top coat. You don't even have to be careful because the whole idea is the tape is going to be like your barrier so you're just going to let that dry for a few minutes and then peel the tape off and then what I did was I did put one coat of top coat over it to sort of protect it a little bit because these chunky glitter type polishes they just they get caught on everything you touch if you touch a towel or a blanket or anything that has uh, fabric to it has a tendency to get stuck on there or you know get caught and it feels awful so I just put a layer of top coat over it to protect it and to help it dry so that's it that's my idea to how to spruce up your manicure it's so easy and like I said you probably already have some scotch tape in your house and a glitter top coat 
and it's it's pretty it's fun it's easy and it will extend the life of your manicure by a few days or till whenever your manicure does end up chipping but why change all your polish if you don't have to you know you can just spruce it up like that so that's my idea and I'll see you next time bye